And now to our top story tonight at 11, the first day of the 2024 legislative session happening today. The Kentucky General Assembly beginning its 60 day legislative session at the state capitol in Frankfurt. ABC 36's Anna Medina has a recap from House Speaker David Osborne. We will continue to be very, uh, very pragmatic and very physically conservative in our budgeting, but also understand that there are places that we can and should invest. As lawmakers met for the first day of the 2024 legislative session to discuss economic development, job growth, and shattering state revenue records, House Speaker David Osborne says one of the biggest topics moving forward will be the state budget. We are able to build the budget much more quickly than usual. Um, there were some, uh, some last-minute changes at personnel um, that we weren't made aware of, of until a couple days ago. Uh, that have caused us to have to change some numbers, which affects, it, it has a domino effect whenever you change personnel numbers because it affects pension contributions. Um, it, 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 it's a domino effect, so it takes a while to, to, to clean all. Osborne says the budget could be unveiled as soon as next week. Right now, he says it's early to say if the House GOP proposal will include any rainy day funds use. We will have, we will end this uh, this fiscal year with you know, four and a half plus billion dollars uh, in the budget reserve, and that's more than we need. The House Speaker also addressing the topic of school choice. I think that there is considerable, considerable interest in, in our uh, caucus to, to do that. Osborne also speaking on what the first House bills could entail. My suspicion is that you will see House Bill 1 be a, a budget or infrastructure bill, uh, something like that. Um, you know, some of the other priorities that, uh, that we've been uh, contemplating would be the uh, Kentucky Safe Act, the, like the crime bill that Jerry Bauman has, has worked on. Governor Andy Bashir will deliver his State of the Commonwealth on Wednesday. In Frankfurt, Anna Medina, ABC 36, on your side.